Most COVID-19 patients are able to recover from home. And that's just what a Terrytown nurse was doing when she was hit with another setback. Criminals struck in the middle of the night. Investigative reporter Mike Pearlstein has that story. As a nurse, Lintrell Peacott is used to taking care of the sick. So lying in bed at home for the past three weeks suffering from COVID-19 was challenging. The symptoms just progressively got worse with shortness of breath and um, nausea and this piercing headache and basically every symptom. She lost people she knows to the virus. A lot of friends, a lot of my friends, family members um, have passed away. Then someone leaving tea on her doorstep alerted her to this. He's like, look at your car. I look down and I have no tires. Tires are completely gone. Ironically, Peacock was having one of her best nights sleep in weeks. Her car was parked here and her bedroom window is right there and she didn't hear a thing. The crime was a major setback. I felt violated because we are all supposed to be on, at a stay at home mandate, right? But obviously they didn't get the memo and they decided to vandalize my car. I cried. Um, you go through a phase where you're crying and then you go through a phase where you're just angry. Peacock's car was towed away today. Another big headache on top of the life-threatening headache she's trying to recover from. Mike Pearlstein, Eyewitness News. We wish her the speediest of recoveries. JP deputies responded to the theft, but as of now, they do not have leads or suspects.